your turn to change it. Yeah, I'm not changing it. It's your turn. Besides, you never like what I put on anyway. I'll give you five dollars if you change it. I'm too old to get up. You're only old when it's convenient for you to be old. What are you reading anyway? Oh, God, not that depressing crap again. It's for my class. <clears throat> what highbrow work of fiction might you be reading? <laughs> Don't be so smug. Man, what a life he has. Don't you just envy him? Why? Because he can sniff anyone's ass he wants. Nice. No. Because he just does what he wants. It was like yesterday. So I was standing in the front yard, and Susan came over to talk. And that little brat of hers, Christopher, came running over, waving that damn gun of his around. And her little dog walked right up, hiked his leg, and peed all over Christopher's tennis shoes. <laughs> uh, all over Christopher, actually. <laughs> and of course, I had to act like I was really upset. <laughs> it was so perfectly executed. I wish you'd seen it. After all the times those kids have tortured that poor guy, I mean, you should take a lesson from them. I mean, they don't, they don't stay up all night worrying. I mean, they've figured out how to get the two of us to do exactly what they want. I mean, they're basically very sophisticated little parasites when you think about it. Well, <laughs> the dumbest creatures are always the happiest. Just look at your mother. They really just live in the moment. It's like now. What could be better than being tucked up here with you? I mean, if I died right now, it'd be okay. Well, it wouldn't be okay with me. So why don't you shut up and go and change the record? Good answer. Oh, you know what? I was thinking about taking him up to Denver with me next week, if it's okay with you. It's my mom. She loves him. Probably that recognition of a similar mind. <laughs> <laughs> You stay there, old man. <laughs>